The eyes cannot see what the mind doesn't know. And as an infectious disease fellow, your mind must be housed a robust list of differential diagnosis so that your eyes don't miss anything. I am extremely fortunate to have trained in a place that offered me a diversity of cases with multiple levels of complexity. We have the opportunity to interact not only during patients' encounters, but also through intersectional educational activities. It is one of my greatest joys working with our fellows as they develop their passions in infectious diseases. I have been at DHMC since 2016 and is the only academic medical center in the state of New Hampshire. We care for the most complex cases in northern New England, including a broad mix of infectious diagnoses. In addition to the common diagnoses, which you'll gain experience on across any of the academic medical centers in the United States, our fellows who train here see infections related to regional occupations and activities such as farming, hunting, lumber, and adventure sports. This brings a diversity of exposures and expertise. Many of our fellows also choose to pursue a Master of Public Health degree as part of a three-year training program. And this includes focused improvement work, both in our healthcare system and in collaboration with our state health department. And I've been incredibly proud of the paths that our fellows follow once they leave our program, each unique and impactful, drawing upon their training and connecting with a vast network of colleagues both across the country and across the world. The community here is really collegial and down to earth and we have a strong culture of learning. Our attendings are all excellent clinicians and relatable role models who are empathetic, patient, and approachable. That diversity has provided depth and nuance to my learning process and has enabled me to understand things in a way that I wouldn't just by reading about it. More importantly, our faculty is truly supportive of us in every way, not just educationally, but also personally outside of the hospital. Some of the most stunning locations in the country are just a short drive or bus ride away. And I feel fortunate to be surrounded by endless outdoor activities and co-fellows who are always up for joining in on the fun. Originally, I'm from Southern California, but I was drawn to Dartmouth because of the unique training experience it offered and the dedicated and caring attendings. As a chief academic fellow in the Infectious Diseases Fellowship at DHMC, this fellowship has been instrumental in developing my leadership skills and has provided me with endless opportunities to refine them. Participation in research is not a requirement in our program, but it's encouraged and there are plenty of opportunities. Prior to fellowship, my research experience was limited, and one of my goals in fellowship was to get at least one publication. I'm involved in a quality improvement project on CLAPSI reduction with the LPMR program. I'm happy to say I've recently gotten my first research paper accepted, and all this happened before I even finished my second year. I co-lead our antimicrobial stewardship program with our ID pharmacist. In addition, I have clinical interest and expertise in the care of immunocompromised hosts. I attended Dartmouth for medical school, and even then, I got a glimpse of the collaborative nature of the institution. It is amazing to me that some of my former teachers are now my colleagues. I think one of the major strengths of this institution is the ability of different disciplines to develop close relationships over time and effectively collaborate in the care of patients. I have really enjoyed working closely with the ID fellows in both the inpatient and outpatient settings. While technically the attending is tasked to be the educator on the team, in reality there is so much that we are able to learn from each other. I learn every day and am inspired by my interactions with the Infectious Disease Fellows. In the Infectious Disease Fellowship here at Dartmouth Health, our commitment to our fellows is our top priority. Fellows in the program get to interact and work alongside an extraordinarily trained faculty, experience a wide variety of cases, and use world-class equipment and technology. In Infectious Disease, we see our fellows as our colleagues and our friends. I've been here at Dartmouth since I finished my fellowship in 2005, and I can honestly say that the reason I came here is because it is an incredible academic and collegial atmosphere in a beautiful setting that provides the highest level of care to a very broad patient population in the state of New Hampshire, much of Vermont, as well as Maine and Massachusetts. Dartmouth Hitchcock Medical Center is a quaternary care level one trauma center with a catchment area of around two million people. The patients we take care of are incredibly complex. 
In fact, we have a case mix index that is one of the highest in the country. All of this makes for an incredible learning environment. We have many opportunities for academics and research, including the opportunity for an MPH through the LPMR program, opportunities to work with our state-of-the-art microbiology laboratory, infection control, stewardship, transplant, HIV, work at our VA, international work, working with our public health departments, and many other options. Here at Dartmouth Health, our philosophy is to make sure you find your passion. We really want to ensure that you are able to get the opportunities and training you need to move your career to the next level.